Hey everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're diving into some exciting new content dropping on Prime Video this July 18th. If you love the original My Spy, you're in for a treat because the sequel, My Spy, The Eternal City, is finally here. Now, let's take a trip down memory lane for a second. The first My Spy hit our screens in June 2020, right when we were all stuck at home, desperately searching for something to keep us entertained during the lockdown. It was a perfect storm, a family-friendly action comedy starring the awesome Dave Bautista and the super-talented Chloe Coleman. Remember how much we all loved that dynamic duo? Bautista playing the tough-as-nails CIA agent turned soft-hearted stepdad, and Coleman as his witty, precocious stepdaughter. Their chemistry was off the charts. Because of the timing and how starved we were for new content, My Spy became one of the most watched streaming movies of that year. It was exactly what we needed to lift our spirits. Naturally, with that kind of success, a sequel was inevitable. But here's the big question, now that we're no longer confined to our homes, will My Spy, The Eternal City capture our hearts the same way the first one did? This time around, Bautista and Coleman are back, and the stakes are higher. They're heading to Europe and getting mixed up in a thrilling terrorist plot. Yep, more action, more laughs, and more of that heartwarming bond that made us fall in love with the first film. And guess what? We also have Ken Jeong and Kristen Schaal returning. You know they're going to bring their unique comedic flair to the movie. So, what's my spy, The Eternal City, all about? Without giving away too many spoilers, Bautista's character is still navigating his role as a CIA agent and stepdad. This time, their mission takes them to some of the most iconic locations in Europe, think breathtaking scenery, high-octane chases, and plenty of edge-of-your-seat moments. But it's not just about the action. The heart of the movie lies in the relationship between Bautista and Coleman's characters. The way they balance the intense, often dangerous situations with genuine, heartfelt moments is what made the first film so special. And from what I've seen, they're going to deliver the same, if not more, in the sequel. I'm really curious to see how this film performs now that we're all free to enjoy the great outdoors and hit the cinemas again. Will it have the same charm and impact? One thing's for sure, the team behind My Spy knows how to create a fun, engaging story that appeals to both kids and adults. So, mark your calendars for July 18th and get ready to stream My Spy, The Eternal City on Prime Video. Whether you're planning a cozy movie night with the family or just looking for a good laugh and some action-packed fun, this sequel promises to deliver. And don't forget to come back here and let me know what you think of the movie. Did it live up to your expectations? How did it compare to the original for you? I can't wait to hear all your thoughts. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my latest reviews and updates. See you next time.